Hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel yes I am doing a voiceover because like I complained in every video there is noise but that's okay messy hair messy face be natural be you in today's video I am going to be doing a painting and I want to take you through and I'm messing up the voiceover So this is a 6 by 6 inch canvas board and I have 4 of these. I'm going to be making 4 of them. You'll see what for towards the end. But yeah, I have my water, my paints, my brushes and let's go. So because it's a small canvas, I'll be using this flat brush. It's old so I don't know the brush number. And I have blue, I have yellow. I also have white to brighten the yellow and I have black to darken the blue as well as magenta which I'll use either of them to darken the blue I'm going to start by taking yellow and doing a very very rough layer like you always need to do a base layer before you do anything so it has to be very rough very random no need to do detailing nothing and just go with the flow just do it same thing with the blue because that's the same pattern we follow irrespective of what you're doing and then we move on to the detailing and next layer of it so that's how it's going to look after the base layers of both the colors, I'm going to use white to brighten the yellow a very small amount and use a very light hand. No pressure because otherwise it's all going to mix up. There's no point then you'll just keep doing the same thing over and over again. So you need to use a very light hand and you can see how it's taking over the green. What I'm going to do next is take some blue because it's a very rough patch and I'm going to very roughly merge it. This is a very very rough merge. You just have to do that to merge both the colors and then wash your brush, dry. You can take out excess color and keep it so you can use it later. Dry it. Okay, like it has to be medium, not fully dry, not fully wet. And uh, this is extremely, extremely light handed, extremely light handed. You can see how it merges. Okay, so you can drag the color slightly inside and anytime you feel that the color is filling up on your brush just wipe it dry and resume your merging i'm going to take some more blue and see you can see how the space is filling up how patchy it was before and how it looks now so i'm going to fill up that with some more color i'm going to take some more color fill up the whole blue patch you can see how the second layer of paint is filling it up Okay, and then I'm going to repeat the same procedure, remove the excess color, wipe, wash my brush, wipe it, dry and uh, resume the shading, the mixing of both, the merging of both. Again, very light handed and you can see how it is merging. It's not patchy, like you cannot see a line in between both the colors. There's a very soft merge in between both, a very, very smooth transition from one color to the other you can do it in circular motions that is also very effective so you can see how it's turning out and now i'm going to fast forward to the results <laughs> yeah let's go what i did here is i why you see the strokes into the blue is because i took the brush i slid the brush from the top corner towards the blue and that's how that's the effect of the yellow I'm now going to write a text which is customized for what has to be done which again you will see towards the end. So yeah, I'm using white and I'm using a round brush. I will insert the brush number in the description. So yeah, fast forward. This is not the speed in which I write <laughs> with a brush definitely. This is a fast forwarded video so please understand. <laughs> What you always need to do is I'm doing it with a very light hand and as a draft so I'm not doing the final thing we will darken it later.
so this was probably the first video where you not see me for like the longest time but i hope you could connect with me with my voice through my voice i did not show the writing part completely because i had to take reference on my phone so it was not really possible to shoot on the phone as well but what i did is you saw the draft that i did and i just went over it twice thrice like you need to understand till when does that fill up completely and like that is pretty much it i made it for my college committee gym khana uh, they had the graduation event for four of the members who graduated and this was for them so if you're watching and you've received it i hope you like it and i enjoyed making it like i actually painted after so long and the shading is my favorite part <laughs> shading is why i love one of the reasons why i love painting so much and let me tell you i finally completed 100 paintings like finally after what 7 months of the year are down so you're going to see 100 paintings part 4 super super soon and we also had rumors of the result being announced today but it is not and it's going to be out in a few days so i'm going to vlog that as well you will see that as well i'm just so <laughs> excited now i'm pumped okay it's like i am pumped now after such gloomy rainy days i am finally back so i'm hoping i can give you a lot of videos now and i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching i will see you in my next video